Spending five nights at Baldi's schoolhouse can't be that bad, right? Right? Hello everybody, I am Kindly Ken and welcome back to Baldi's Basics. I am very excited to check out this mod, Baldi's Basics in Five Nights. So this is a mod that is based on the game that uh, Ger Watt made. We've played it in the past, Five Nights at Baldi's Basics. It's the one that has Golden Baldi in it. But this is more like Baldi's Basics, but with the Five Nights at- The music just stopped. Why? I don't know if it's creepier with or without the music. But anyways, this is based on Jerowat's game, but this is a Baldi's Basics mod, so it plays like Baldi's Basics. I have no idea what I'm getting myself into here. Let's just start the mod. It looks really cool right off the bat. I love the title screen. Let's start mod. Oh, and of course, it's made by Baldi Makes Mods. That's the maker, not Baldi. Baldi doesn't make mods, but the maker is Baldi Makes Mods. Let's just start. We have options. Night one. I guess we'll start with night one. Let's play. <laughs> what? Hello, playtime. <laughs> Let's not commence play. It's not going. What is? Oh, click. Okay. It is 12 a.m. It is night one, and here we are in the dark school. I guess it's very weird. Um, do I get notebooks? There are notebooks here, so I will collect them. Hey, Baldy, I guess you work evenings too, huh, buddy? Okay. Ain't no rest for math teachers. Uh, ain't that true? All right. I answered your questions. Are you going to give me a quarter? It's now 1 a.m. Huh. Very interesting. I don't exactly understand how this works, but I guess we collect the notebooks like we would in a typical... Baldi's basics game, and then and then we're each time we collect one, it, it it teleports us an hour in time. I don't know. It's now 2 a.m., so that's good. We gotta get to 6 a.m. That's the basic premise of the whole Five Nights thing. But now I did notice that playtime was kind of like the the character associated with this night. So is she the only? One that we need to worry about it, this is very weird. I mean, I don't hear Baldi He's here to give us math problems, but he's not here to destroy us with his ruler, which you know I'm okay with we've made it to 3 a.m. It's very exciting There's still weird noises happening inside the school So that never goes away. That's good to know. You know what kind of sounds like it sounds like when your refrigerator kicks on You know what I'm talking about. Maybe not. Maybe I'm the only crazy one. Wait Hello is that first prize? First prize, hello? I hear I hear the sound of a robot. Are you? What? Oh no! Okay, playtime is here. Um, I don't know if she'll she'll end our game if she catches us. I don't actually know how this works. <laughs> I'm very confused. There's a lot of confusion going on right now. That's okay. Confusion is half the fun. Or something. It does sound like First prize is here, but he's not. Wait! Oh! He's out of order. Are you... I'll fix it soon, don't worry. Okay. I kind of feel bad just leaving him in the corner there. He seems kind of, kind of sad. <laughs> Alright, see you later, first prize. Hope you get fixed soon, buddy. You keep doing your thing. You know what? I'm gonna grab a soda. Because I don't think I want to come in contact with playtime. I think that will end our run, but I'm not sure, but I don't really want to find out. So if she does get close to us, we will blast her with the soda. <gasps> okay, she didn't see us. <laughs> We're good. Let's make it 5 a.m., shall we? The math doesn't check out, though. If we get two more notebooks, which is what's left, it's going to be 7 a.m. I thought the whole Five Nights thing was making it to 6 a.m., whatever. Maybe it'll take us to 5.30 a.m. and then the last one will get us to 6 a.m. either way I don't really care let's just get these notebooks and get out of here no mm, I don't know what to do um you know what I know exactly what to do just run just run we don't have to worry about getting detention principal is he's at home sleeping I would think unless well you know he's a principal he's probably waking up right now at 6 a.m. he's got to get his day started but either way I hate the fact that playtime is chasing me and that she's even here 
Why is she at school at 6 a.m. in the morning? <gasps> no! Get away! Get away! I'm gonna shoot you. I shoot you. I blasted her. Don't talk to me. Do you think she knows where I am? Let's just grab the last notebook and hope that she has no idea where we are right now. We've done it. Are we gonna get yelled at? I don't... That would be weird. Maybe? I don't know. Okay, we definitely got yelled at, but it was way quieter than it normally is. And there was a section there where I feel like it wasn't Baldi's voice. <laughs> it was kind of weird. It was hard to tell. All right, everything is turned red. Gotta love that. Remember, we can run. We don't have to worry about principle. Please don't hurt me, Playtime. I haven't seen her. So far, so good. I really wish that I had a candy bar right now, though. Okay, only one more exit to get. Please, no playtime. Please don't hurt me. I feel like she's gonna be right around the corner. I don't hear her though, but also my ears are bleeding because of this very loud noise. So I might not be able to hear her anyways. Are we good? I think we're good. I think we're free. We've done it. Night one, escape. <laughs> Did it just say you beat my dinner? What? Okay, we've successfully survived night one. I wanna look at the different nights, but I don't know if I'm gonna play through them. Let's go night two, let's see. Okay, so is night two just the principal? Is, is he the only obstacle in our path? Let's find out. And then also, let's see what happens if they actually do run into you. But this time, I'm gonna let it happen. I'm going to accept my fate, and Principal is going to catch us, and we'll see if that ends the run. Just listen out for the whistles. Oh! Whoa! Okay. We've definitely got playtime, and, uh, we're not dead, so that's good. But what if Principal catches us? I saw him for a second. Where'd he go? <laughs> Principal! Okay, whatever. You know what? Let's just grab the next notebook. It's right here. Might as well grab it. Oh, I was not typing into the into the answer pad, so I got the answer wrong, and this is my punishment. I don't think it really matters. Hey, you! Get me! No running of Ooh, that makes me dead. <laughs> okay. Very, very interesting. So, it does appear that whoever the main character is for a specific night uh, will end your run if they catch you. But the interesting thing about Principal is that he doesn't really chase you unless you do something that makes him upset. So I feel like night two would actually be pretty easy. Now what is night three? Hello. It's Baldi. Welcome to this pool. Go drop on my kitty tonight, friend. I finally got him. I don't understand anything that you just said, Baldi. I'm sorry. The music is slowed down. Okay, that's a little strange. I'm just gonna get the first two notebooks and then let's see what happens. That was great. Here, send some fun to here. You can get a quarter. Use it well done. What? Use it well done? Is that what he said? Typically, I don't take my quarters like I take my steak. Problem, ready or not, here I come. Oh. Apparently Baldi thinks that we're playing hide and seek. Well, this is a game of hide and seek that I do not want to play, sir. Hello. Are you just you're just normal, angry Baldi? You're gonna destroy me with your ruler? I'm I'm going to. Here's the moment. It's. Yep. <laughs> okay. So night three kind of feels like just just standard Baldi's basics, to be honest with you. Let's see what night four is all about. Give me something great. Bully? Bully's the bad guy in night four? Is Oh, oh no. Baldy is here, and also it is much darker than it used to be. This is very upsetting. I can barely see anything. Baldy, though, you're glowing. You're glowing, buddy. You're very bright. The music is slower than it was before, which, you know, take that as it is. It's kind of kind of creepy. Hello? What? Why did you say- why, why is Bully talking? You don't think Bully's gonna actually chase us, do you? I don't think so. 
my Tom. Please don't. All right, so Baldy is alive and well, and uh, he's God's ruler, and he's not afraid to use it. So why was Bully kind of the the quote unquote main character for Night Four? Is it just that he's here now? Uh, uh, uh. That's that's not Bully. Now that I think about it, that's uh, that's that's what is like. Okay. Uh huh. Yep. He will kill you. Um. It, what is the name of that thing? Placeholder. I think. It, yeah. Okay. So night four introduces placeholder. Let's move on to the final night. Well, I hate this. My cursor is red first prize. <laughs> what? Okay, I can barely see anything at this point. This is very, very upsetting. I have lost you. These voices! I hate them! Please, let me in. I, I'm just kind of guessing where the doors are because I can't see them. I honestly cannot see the doors. I don't know if you guys can. You might be able to see better than I can. But what I'm looking at is darkness and sadness. And and that voice, that is something special right there. Um, Please tell me this is the... The, the right way? Okay, it is. It is. Whoa, there's Golden Baldy! I saw Golden Baldy. What is Golden Baldy doing here? Why? I gotta get I gotta get closer. I gotta see what Golden Baldy's all about. I mean he can't be good. He can't help us, right? Like he was he was there, but he's not there anymore. He's gone. Where did Golden Baldy go? Hello? Okay. I, I think there's a door here, right? Please tell me. Please. Principal is very fast, by the way. For the record. Okay, the fact that Golden Baldy is wandering these hallways right now is freaking me out. <laughs> I, I kind of hate it. Oh gosh, I can't see. Please. Please, where am I? I... Oh gosh. Where... Oh! Oh, that makes me sad. Yeah, that makes me pretty sad too. Okay, uh, night five is horrifying. Um, I do want to get back in here and just see if we can interact with Golden Baldy. I'm just gonna try to get through these notebooks as quickly as possible if I can actually find the doors to the classrooms. Goodness gracious. Okay, I think I've done it. I've. Oh gosh, I don't. Oh, there's the door. Okay, thank you. Golden Baldy! Oh, that makes me sad. I saw him for a split second. Just a, just a brief moment. Please let me out. Please. Okay. I don't see Golden Baldy this time. He's not over there. Oh, there he was. Let's go say hello. Hello, Golden Baldy. Don't. Oh, that makes me sad. Well, I was going to say don't hurt me, but uh, he hurt me. I thought Golden Baldy maybe was on my side, you know? Hook me up. Help me out. So, uh, this mod ramped up real fast. Nights one through three, I would say, pretty easy, pretty tame. Four and five, nightmare fuel. Especially five. I can't see anything. I, I was literally just clicking on the walls in the vicinity where I thought the doors were. Hoping. Praying. That was horrifying. But there you have it, guys. Baldi's Basics in Five Nights. Very, very cool mod. I will have a link in the description down below if you guys want to check it out for yourselves. Avoid Golden Baldi at all costs. But that is going to do it for this episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo on it right below this window. You can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.